Today, more school communities are out in full force ahead of their own school budget votes, and people in one district are looking to make some noise during a hunk and wave event. NBC5's Adrian Pastor joins us live from where the action is happening in Essex Junction. Hey, Adrian. Yeah, Liz, Brian, this crowd has grown in immensely with just within the last hour or so. There are folks stationed on every corner here of Five Corners here in Essex Junction, and that consists of parents, people from the district, and even students who are looking to call attention to this vote that's happening tomorrow for this next year's school budget. Now, organizers of the Honk and Wave are hoping to engage with as many people as possible at one of the area's busiest intersections. The school district says this revised budget is $4.5 million less than the first time around, and some of that money was expected to go towards capital improvements, but that have been pushed to next year. Now, while it did take some time, leaders believe they've accomplished a more balanced budget. We want folks to be informed and engage voters uh, come tomorrow. Um, obviously, there's concerns for certain staff, for certain programs. We did our best, we feel, to honor the community's wishes, and we want people to take a look at it, learn for themselves. And under this new budget, neighbors can expect to see a decrease in their property tax rate of about 0.76% compared to last year. Now, voting will be open tomorrow starting at 7 o'clock over at the Champlain Valley Expo, the Essex Middle School, and the Westford School as well. We're live in Essex Junction tonight. Adrian Pastor, NBC5 News.